Are you planning to take the Philippine Master Plumbing Licensure Exam? Welcome to Audio Review. If you're new to this channel, let us give you a quick intro. Audio Review aims to help individuals to prepare for their upcoming licensure exam. We have tons of review videos for you to study. So don't forget to hit like, click subscribe and ring that notification bell to be updated. Are you ready? For this video, we will be asking you 30 random questions in sanitation, plumbing design and installation. Let us start. What is the color of the symbol for Class C fire extinguishers? Is it A. Black B. Yellow C. Blue D. Green The answer? It's blue. How about the color of the symbol for Class D fire extinguishers? Is it A. Black B. Yellow C. Blue D. Green The answer? It's yellow. What is the color of the symbol for Class K fire extinguishers? Is it A. Black. B. Yellow. C. Blue. D. Green. The answer? It's black. Sources of water shall be in accordance with what? A. PNSDW. B. DOH. C. NPCP. D. NVCP. The answer? It's PNSDW. Or Philippine National Standards for Drinking Water 2007. Again. Sources of water shall be in accordance with PNSDW or Philippine National Standards for Drinking Water 2007. The physical or chemical quality of water conforming to the safety of drinking water. Is it A. Acceptability B. Purity C. Turbidity D. Chlorination The answer? It's acceptability. Acceptability is the physical or chemical quality of water conforming to the safety of drinking water. Bacteria that occurs only in the presence of oxygen. A. Anaerobic bacteria. B. Aerobic bacteria. C. Effluent. D. Both A and B. The answer? It's aerobic bacteria. Aerobic bacteria is the bacteria that occurs only in the presence of oxygen. Aerobic. Oxygen. The process of adding chlorine for water disinfection. A. Chlorination. B. Disinfection. C. Both A and B. D. None of the above. The answer? It's chlorination. Chlorination is the process of adding chlorine for water disinfection. The length of time where water supply is held in direct contact with a treating agent. A. Chlorination. B. Disinfection. C. Frequency. D. Contact time. The answer? It's contact time. Contact time is the length of time where water supply is held in direct contact with a treating agent. An outflowing of water from a natural body of water or from sewage treatment facility. A. Sewage. B. Effluent. C. Storm water. D. Byproduct. The answer? It's effluent. Effluent is an outflowing of water from a natural body of water or from sewage treatment facility. Loss of soluble substances from ores, rock formations, or plumbing materials into groundwater. A. Leaching. B. Solvent. C. Effluent. D. Drainage. The answer? It's leaching. Leaching is the loss of soluble substances from ores, rock formations, or plumbing materials into groundwater. A substance in which other material dissolve to form a solution. A. Chlorine. B. Solvent. C. Effluent. D. Drainage. The answer? It's solvent. Solvent is a substance in which other material dissolve to form a solution. What is the universal solvent? A. Alkaline. B. Acid. C. Water. D. Effluent. The answer? It's water. Water is the universal solvent. It is a cloudiness or haziness of water or other liquid caused by individual particles that are too small to be seen without magnification. A. Algae. B. Turbidity. C. Acidity. D. Sulfuric. The answer? It's turbidity. Turbidity is a cloudiness or haziness of water or other liquid caused by individual particles that are too small to be seen without magnification. Turbidity. It is a protected well without distribution systems. Generally adaptable in rural areas. Serves 15 to 25 households and not more than 250 meters from the farthest user. A. Level 1 or point source. B. Level 2 or communal faucet systems. C. Level 3 or waterwork system. D. 
Level 4 or individual house connection? The answer? It's level 1 or point source. Level 1 or point source is a protected well without distribution systems. Generally adaptable in rural areas. Serves 15 to 25 households and not more than 250 meters from the farthest user. That is so sweet. You're still here. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to be updated. Next question. It is composed of a source or a reservoir with piped distribution networks and communal faucets. Located no more than 25 meters from the farthest house. Suitable for rural or urban areas densely clustered to justify simple pipe network. Is it? A. Level 1 or point source. B. Level 2 or communal faucet systems. C. Level 3 or waterworks system. D. Level 4 or individual house connection. The answer? It's level 2 or communal faucet systems. Level 2 or communal faucet systems is composed of a source slash reservoir with piped distribution networks and communal faucets. Located no more than 25 meters from the farthest house. Suitable for rural or urban areas densely clustered to justify simple pipe network. It is composed of a source or reservoir with pipe distribution network with household taps. It is suitable for densely populated areas. A. Level 1. B. Level 2. C. Level 3. D. Level 4. The answer? It's level 3 or waterworks system or individual house connections. Level 3 or waterworks system or individual house connections is composed of a source or reservoir with pipe distribution network with household taps. It is suitable for densely populated areas. What is the volume or amount of drinking water used for physical and chemical analysis? A. 50 milliliters. B. 100 milliliters. C. 150 milliliters. D. 200 milliliters. The answer? It's 100 milliliters. 100 milliliters is the volume or amount of drinking water used for physical and chemical analysis. It is the sequence of conditions through which water passes from vapor in the atmosphere through precipitation upon land or water surfaces and ultimately back into the atmosphere as a result of evaporation and transpiration. A. Collection. B. Leaching. C. Hydrological cycle. D. None of the above. The answer? Hydrological cycle. Hydrological cycle is the sequence of conditions through which water passes from vapor in the atmosphere through precipitation upon land or water surfaces and ultimately back into the atmosphere as a result of evaporation and transpiration. It is the change of water from its gaseous form or water vapor into liquid water. A. Evaporation. B. Condensation. C. Melting. D. Precipitation. The answer? It's condensation. Condensation is the change of water from its gaseous form or water vapor into liquid water. Sources of water. It usually comes in abundant supply. It is obtained from underground by means of mechanical and manual equipment. A. Rainwater. B. Groundwater. C. Natural surface water. D. All of the above. The answer? It's groundwater. Groundwater usually comes in abundant supply. It is obtained from underground by means of mechanical and manual equipment. Sources of water. It is available only during the wet season. The water is soft and pure. It's suitable for hot water supply system. It is stored in cisterns or ponds. A. Rainwater. B. Groundwater. C. Natural surface water. D. All of the above. The answer? It's rainwater. Rainwater is available only during the wet season. The water is soft and pure. It's suitable for hot water supply system. It is stored in cisterns or ponds. Whoa, you're still listening. Have you subscribed already? If not yet, what are you waiting for? Next question. Sources of water. It is obtained from ponds, lakes, rivers, and impounding reservoirs. It is a mixture of surface runoff and groundwater and can easily be contaminated. A. Rainwater. B. Groundwater. C. Natural surface water. D. All of the above. The answer? Natural surface water. Natural surface water is obtained from ponds, lakes, rivers, and impounding reservoirs. It is a mixture of surface runoff and groundwater and can easily be contaminated. Which of the following is the advantage of rainwater as source of water? A. Water is soft and pure. B. 
suitable for hot water supply system. C. Both A and B. D. None of the above. The answer? It's both A and B. Water is soft and pure. It is suitable for hot water supply system. The presence of this in water produces hardness, impaired laundry and cooking, and clogging of pipes. A. Calcium. B. Magnesium. C. Both A and B. D. None of the above. The answer? It's both calcium and magnesium. The presence of this in water produces bad taste and odor. It is highly corrosive to plumbing and stains clothing. A. Calcium. B. Magnesium. C. Sulfur. D. Iron. The answer? It's sulfur. The presence of sulfur in water produces bad taste and odor. It is highly corrosive to plumbing and stains clothing. The presence of this in water stains clothing and plumbing fixtures. It interferes with water softeners. A. Calcium. B. Magnesium. C. Sulfur. D. Iron. The answer? It's iron. The presence of iron in water stains clothing and plumbing fixtures. It interferes with water softeners. The presence of this in water is unhealthy. It can cause poliomyelitis. A. Pathogenic germs. B. Algae. C. Sulfur. D. Iron. The answer? It's pathogenic germs. Pathogenic germs can cause poliomyelitis. In order to treat water hardness caused by calcium and magnesium, which of the following treatment is used? A. Addition of water softeners. B. Boiling. C. Use of iron exchanger. D. All of the above. The answer? It's all of the above. In order to treat water hardness caused by calcium and magnesium, the following treatment is used. Addition of water softeners, boiling, and use of iron exchanger. It is a process by which air is circulated through, mixed with or dissolved in a liquid or substance. It is a process where water is exposed to air by spraying, applying or engaging it into the atmosphere or air. A. Coagulation. B. Filtration. C. Aeration. D. Flocculation. The answer? It's aeration. Aeration is a process by which air is circulated through, mixed with or dissolved in a liquid or substance. It is a process where water is exposed to air by spraying, applying or engaging it into the atmosphere or air. What is the color of the symbol for Class C fire extinguishers? Is it A. Black B. Yellow C. Blue D. Green The answer? It's blue. How about the color of the symbol for Class D fire extinguishers? Is it A. Black B. Yellow C. Blue D. Green The answer? It's yellow. What is the color of the symbol for Class K fire extinguishers? Is it A. Black B. Yellow C. Blue D. Green The answer? It's black. Sources of water shall be in accordance with what? A. PNSDW B. DOH C. NPCP D. NVCP The answer? It's PNSDW or Philippine National Standards for Drinking Water 2007. Again, sources of water shall be in accordance with PNSDW, or Philippine National Standards for Drinking Water 2007. The physical or chemical quality of water conforming to the safety of drinking water. Is it A. Acceptability B. Purity C. Turbidity D. Chlorination The answer? It's acceptability. Acceptability is the physical or chemical quality of water conforming to the safety of drinking water. Bacteria that occurs only in the presence of oxygen. A. Anaerobic bacteria. B. Aerobic bacteria. C. Effluent. D. Both A and B. The answer? It's aerobic bacteria. Aerobic bacteria is the bacteria that occurs only in the presence of oxygen. Aerobic. Oxygen. Whoa. You're still listening. Have you subscribed already? If not yet, what are you waiting for? Next question. The process of adding chlorine for water disinfection. A. Chlorination. B. Disinfection. C. Both A and B. D. None of the above. The answer? It's chlorination. 
Chlorination is the process of adding chlorine for water disinfection. The length of time where water supply is held in direct contact with a treating agent. A. Chlorination. B. Disinfection. C. Frequency. D. Contact time. The answer? It's contact time. Contact time is the length of time where water supply is held in direct contact with a treating agent. An outflowing of water from a natural body of water or from sewage treatment facility. A. Sewage. B. Effluent. C. Storm water. D. Byproduct. The answer? It's effluent. Effluent is an outflowing of water from a natural body of water or from sewage treatment facility. Well, how about that? You finished all 30 questions. How was your score? Are you up for more? You can replay or continue to our other videos. Thank you for finishing the video. We have good news. Audio Review is giving away free reviewers. The mechanics? It's simple. Subscribe to our channel, share us to your socials, and that's it. Email a screenshot to the email address we have provided with the subject, request for reviewers underscore MP. Hope we can help. We still have more review videos. Don't forget to hit like, click subscribe and ring that notification bell to be updated.